Hi and welcome to week 17 of World History 2. So this week wraps up with a student-led conference, so it's a special week. Uh, the innovative approach of student-led conferences, uh, unlike traditional conference, parent-teacher conferences, uh, student-led ones empower students to actively shape their learning journey. So in this context, students engage in reflective practices that transcend conventional uh, reflection on the topics themselves. Reflections extend beyond mere recall of historical facts, per se. They involve a deep contemplation of personal growth, challenges faced, and profound connections made with significant historical events and theories. Through dynamic discussions, structured journaling, and collaborative activities, students will craft a narrative that not only showcases their academic progress, but also cultivates a nuanced understanding of the, hist of the material itself. This personalized reflection becomes a uh, can become a foundational aspect of their journey towards academic and historical literacy. So as we transition into the second day of preparation, the focus will be on presentations, a platform where students bring their reflections to life. Each presentation is an immersive experience, incorporating personal anecdotes and a comprehensive overview of their, of their learning journey. This dynamic approach creates a classroom environment where peers actively engage with each other's experiences, providing constructive feedback and collectively contributing to a more profound understanding of themselves and of their academics. These presentations can become a testament to the collaborative nature of learning, where the journey towards literacy in the historical sense becomes a shared exploration. Moving on, in the middle of the week, we're going to shift our attention back into the material. Uh, we're, going to, we're going to do a fascinating exploration of the process through which South American nations gained independence, with a particular focus on the transformative role played by Simon Bolivar. So the, this tumultuous era was marked by socio-political upheaval, and Bolivar emerged as a visionary leader who galvanized the fight for liberation. We'll delve into the multifaceted circumstances that led to this quest of, for independence, examining key battles, socioeconomic complexities, and the overarching impact of Bolivar's vision on shaping the destiny of South American nations. Next, we'll turn our attention to Europe, Italy more specifically. We're going to evaluate the intricate roles played by Cavour and Garibaldi in the unification of Italy. The 19th century witnessed a fragmented Italian peninsula, and the efforts of, those, of these two figures significantly shaped the course of Italian unification. Cavour's political acumen and diplomatic maneuvering, coupled with Garibaldi's military prowess and charismatic leadership, played comp complementary roles in achieving the dream for a unified Italy. We'll explore the political landscape, the challenges faced, the strategies employed, and the ultimate success that marked this transformative period in Italian history. So through this detailed analysis, we aim to appreciate not only the political dynamics, but also the cultural and societal factors that can contributed to the shaping of a unified Italy. Thank you, and I look forward to working with you all next week.